Hello friends, the question is like this. We have to evaluate this definite integral e to the power of x into 1 minus sin x upon 1 minus cos x with respect to x from the limit s pi by 2 to pi. Okay. So friends, to solve this question, first of all, what has to be done is the simplification of this term 1 minus sin x upon 1 minus cos x. As our experience, because e to the power of x multiply with this term, so we check that whether this term cannot or can be converted into the sum of two functions or two terms, one as a function and other which can be taken as a derivative. If it is, if it is possible, then this question would take a very easy form. Okay, so we are going to start solving this term and we are going to convert it into the sum of a function and its derivative. So we take the given fraction, okay, and we can write this fraction as 1 minus 2 sin x by 2 into cos x by 2 by applying the formula of sin 2a, which is equal to 2 sin a cos a, and for cos x I can write 1 minus 2 sin a square x by 2, and because of minus sign multiplying with cos x, I'm going to have minus 1 plus 2 sin a square x by 2, okay? This 1 and 1 cancels to give me this term. This sin a square x is divided separately by 1 and this term to give me 1 upon 2 sin a square x by 2 minus 2 sin x by 2 cos x by 2 upon 2 sin a square x by 2. This can be written as 1 by 2 times cos x square x by 2. This 2 and 2 cancels. Sin x by 2 cancel with and 1 power become less of sin square term. So I'm going to get cos x by 2 upon sin x by 2. So this can be written as cot x by 2. Or this can be written as minus cot x by 2 plus 1 by 2 cos x square x by 2. Okay. So we can write this integral as equal to integration of e to the power of x into minus cot x by 2 plus 1 by 2 times cos x square x by 2 dx from the limit pi by 2 to pi. Okay. Now, if fx is assumed to be as minus cot x by 2, then f dash x can be written as or would be equal to d by by dx of minus cot x by 2 differentiation of minus cot x by 2 would be 1 by 2 cos x square x by 2 now you can check it also differentiation of cot would be cos x square minus cos x square so minus minus become plus and differentiation of x by 2 would be 1 by 2 so I obtain 1 by 2 here okay so if we take this integral it is in the form of e to the power of x times fx plus f dash x dx. So its value can be written directly as equal to e to the power of x into fx plus c. Okay, so because it is a definite integral, we are not going to place c and we are going to write the value of i as equal to e to the power of x times minus cot x by 2 from the limit pi by 2 to pi. I hope it is very very clear that how we have obtained the value of i as equal to this much. Simply I have solved this integral as equal to e to the power of x into minus cot x by 2 and place the limit. Okay and further this will be equal to on applying the limits e to the power of pi minus cot pi by 2 minus e to the power of pi by 2 minus cot pi by 4. Okay so cot pi by 2 means cot 90 so it will be equal to 0 so this whole term will become 0 cot pi by 4 cot 45 equal to 1 minus minus become plus so I get this value as equal to e to the power of pi by 2 further I've show, I've, I've, as explained this is going to become e to the power of pi by 2 so this will be my required answer so this is how I'm going to solve this question friends Thanks for 
watching my video to watch more of these super videos and for the latest updates subscribe and like the videos on these channels on youtube hsk shiksha and math help by hsk thank you